All right, hands-on challenge time, guys. This is too easy, actually. I was hoping so more of a fun challenge, but that's okay. Let's do this challenge. So first off, let's pop up our trailhead playground to work on. I'm gonna pop this up and then go to the trailhead and launch developer console. And uh, gear icon as usual, developer console, pop this up. It's a bit slow right now. All right, we got developer console. I'm gonna close the codes from the previous video and flip back here to the challenge. So scroll down basically create a visual force page which shows a basic contact record okay so basically it's just displaying first name last name and the owner of the contact email wow that's actually you can just copy paste the whole thing from the example we have here right this is exactly the same thing so I'm going to flip back to my developer console, create a new visual force page there. Name it contact view. We will have a new um, visual force page and let's go back to our example and copy this whole thing. Okay. So it's an Apex page. The standard controller is account. So we will change this to contact. All right. And then I'm going to change this to contact summary. And we are going to um, flip. And what do we need to put there? First name, last name, and owner email. Okay. So first name, last name last name and owner email the owner of the contact whoever creates the contact okay so we are going to say contact dot first name contact dot last name contact dot owner dot email this is a related this is a lookup field and then you choose uh, a lookup object to the owner and then you choose the field which is email okay so contact contact and we can save this okay now it's happy we can try this out if i flip back to my Trailhead Playground and go to contacts here. Let's do Carol Ruiz. So you can copy the contact page there, right? If I copy there, and then if I go back to my developer console and hit preview, and then we change this at an ID and, right? ID equals what we just copied there. First name Carol Ru. Oh, last name Ruiz, the owner email is student at so on.io. That's it. So you basically copy this. This is just for testing. It's not required for the challenge. But to test if your page is working, you copy that and you pass ID. Use the emphasis sign and ID equals record ID. It should display just that. That's too easy, right? So let's grab the points and I'll see you on the next video where we talk about display records, fields, and tables. That's more interesting and more fun. So I'll see you on the next video. Bada bing and bada boom. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps 
on the Salesforce App Exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.